hello everyone hope you all are doing great guys today in this video we are going to troubleshoot one ticket and ticket is in front of you r1 should use upper path as a best path to forward traffic in 192.168.20.0/24 but it's using lower path okay first of all let me make you familiar with this topology as you can see in my topology there are two lan lan number 1 and lan number 2 In LAN one, I am using IP address from this network 192.168.10.0/24 network, and in LAN two, I am using IP address from this network 192.168.20.0/24 network. Between R one and R four, we have two link. As you can see, R one have two choice. Either it can forward traffic to R two or to R three, but we have more bandwidth over here between R two and R one. And R2 and R4, but we have less bandwidth in between R1 and R3 and R3 and R4. So according to EAGRP, which will which should be the best path? Best best path should be the upper path. This path should be best path because as you know EAGRP calculate metric on the basis of bandwidth and delay by default. So it will calculate list metric by uh from their neighbor router 2 and it will calculate more bandwidth from their neighbor router number 3 so but the reason is the problem is actually r1 is installing 192.168.20.0 network via router number 3 but it should install it via router number 2 so this is problem and we need to troubleshoot it we need to find the problem over here we need to fix it first of all let me verify Really, R1 is uh, installing best path via router number three. For that, I need to run command so ip route eigrp, and you can see 192.168.20.0/24, and this one is the metric, and definitely this network is reachable via router number three. 13.1.1.3 is the ip address of router three, right? Let me find the alternate path. so ip eagrp topology all let me check the all link no there is only one path between source and destination that's why router 1 is installing worst path in their routing table path via router number 3 now we need to find the reason why router is not receiving the prefix from their other neighbor from router number 2 so first of all we need to verify the neighborship over here this is the first step to troubleshoot this scenario so ip eagrp neighbor this command you will run to check the neighborship is fine between both neighbor or not so so ip eagrp neighbor so okay neighbor router 3 is also neighbor and router 2 is also neighbor both neighbor is fine yes or no okay Here on router number one, I am not able to see any problem, but just I need to check the filtering. Is there any filtering configured, guys? So what we can check? So IP protocol. We can run this command to check the filtering. So IP protocol. After running this command, you can see outgoing update filtering list for all traffic is not set. Incoming update filter for filter list for all traffic is. not set means filtering is not set over here on router number 1 that means on router number 1 everything is fine or you can verify by running command so access list as well so access list there is no any access control list so prefix list so ip prefix list there is no any prefix list as well and so ip route map there is no any sorry so ip so route map there is no any route map as well that means on router number 1 i don't need to configure anything just i need to check the connectivity between both default gateway so let me ping router 2 ping 12.1.1.2 yes i am able to ping router 2 ping 13.1.1.3 definitely i am able to ping 13.3 as well okay and uh, so ip interface brief exclude unassign on my 
LAN interface you can see I am running IP 10.100 ok so here configuration is done now let me take you on router number 2 I will config I will check configuration step by step here I am going to find the neighborship first so IP EIGRP neighbor before running this command let me ok so there is only one neighbor that is router 2 there is no neighborship between router 2 and router 4 now this is the reason why router 1 is not getting this prefix 192.168.20.0 prefix via router number 2 because neighborship between router 2 and router 4 is not there neighborship between router 2 and router 4 is not there as you can see router 2 have only one neighbor that is 12.1.1.1 now I am going to ping the router number 4 so IP interface brief exclude unassign here I am running IP 24.2 and on router number 4 I am running 24.4 so let me check the connectivity between router 2 and router 4 24.1.1.4 yes I am able to ping router 4 but then why EIGRP neighborship is not there so what I need to do just I need to check the filtering so IP protocol here also you can see filtering is not configured for incoming and outgoing traffic right and uh, I am performing routing for 12 network as well and for 20 network 24 network as well that means routing is also done both gateway is reachable then don't know why EIGRP neighborship is not there now we need to find we need to troubleshoot R4 let me take you directly on router number 4 because here you can see from router number 2 I am able to ping both gateway and neighborship with 12.1.1.1 is fine but neighborship with 24.1.1.4 is not uh, there so let me run one more command so run section EIGRP how many command engineer have run over here so router EIGRP 10 yes number 10 I am using and network 12.1.1.0 and network 24.1.1.0 ok configuration of router 2 is perfect now let me take you on router number 4 here I am going to check so IP EIGRP neighbor so you can see here also only router 3 is neighbor of router 4 that means neighborship with router 2 is not there definitely problem is between router 2 and router 4 now till now it's very clear that problem is between router 2 and router number 4 only so what we do first thing that you will do is filtering first of all you need to check so IP protocol here you can see filtering for inbound and outbound is not configure and I have advertised all interface in EIGRP you can see done so here also I am not able to see any problem right now what I am going to do on router number one let me ping my neighbor 24.1.1.2 yes I am able to ping and so IP interface brief exclude unassign on LAN interface IP address is absolutely fine correct now what I am going to do I am going to check the running configuration of EIGRP so run section EIGRP so router EIGRP S number 10 perfect network 24.1.1.0 slash 24 perfect network 34.1.1.0 slash 24 perfect network 192.168.20.0 perfect and passive interface fast ethernet 0 slash 0 oh passive interface fast ethernet 0 slash 0 passive interface should be your LAN interface but here engineer have configured this interface as passive interface if this interface is passive interface that means router 4 is not going to send any traffic from here yes or no not hello message and not any update message so actually router 4 is not sending hello message from here that's why neighborship is not there between router 2 and router number 4 
passive interface should be configured on your LAN interface, on this interface, not on the WAN interface, on this interface, right? Okay. So this is problem, guys, and this is the reason why router one is no receiving 192.168.20.0 slash 24 network via router number three. Done. So again, I am going to now fix it. So how we will fix it? Say router EGRP yes number ten. And here I am going to copy this command and let me say no and let me paste it over here. Now so you can see now EAGRP neighborship is up between router 2 and router number 4. So IP EAGRP neighbor. Now again I am going to check the router 1 configuration sorry path routing table. So IP route EAGRP. Okay, now you can see this network is reachable via 12.1.1.2 and if you will run command Okay, now you can check the alternate path is available in topology table or not. So IP EAGRP topology or link Here you can see both path is now available in topology table in routing table router will install only best path so this was just a small troubleshooting guys this is how you can troubleshoot in real time also by mistake sometime engineer uh, configured the passive interface on WAN interface because of that this type of problem you can face in real time okay if you have learned something from this video please hit on like button guys if you have not subscribed this channel please subscribe this channel as well bye bye we will meet soon in next video till then stay safe